Schumacher's wife arrived at the Grenoble Hospital this morning, along with friends of the family doctor, Gerard Salient, and FIA president, Jean Todt. Yesterday, Schumacher's friend and Formula F1 driver, Philippe Streif, said he had spoken with Dr. Gerard Salant, whom had said to him Michael's life is not in danger anymore. Yet the hospital has not released any details to confirm this. Meanwhile, investigators are examining Schumacher's camera on his helmet and questioning his son, who was with his dad at the time of the incident. Schumacher's manager, Sabine Kem, has regularly spoken to the media for the past week and repeated the same statement she was given Tuesday. His condition is stable, but still critical. The former F1 driver's father, Rolf, and brother, Ralph, also arrived to give their support. Ferrari fans also arrived in busloads yesterday to give support to their hero on his 45th birthday on Friday. Schumacher slammed his head against a rock on Sunday while skiing near Meribel and has had two operations to remove bleeding and pressure on his brain. He is being kept in an induced coma and the latest health update given by his manager on Wednesday described his condition as stable but still critical.